I finished servicing the machine. I checked over the motor. I was going to rebuild it, tear it apart, but you know what? The communicators were still shiny. The motor hardly hasn't been used, so I just oiled the bearings and put it in the machine, and we're good to go. Uh, as far as the recap goes, let's see. We yanked out the 404 motor, modified the housing, put in the connector from the 620, put in the motor from the 620, and this is the end result, ladies and gentlemen. I've got a switch. If I push it all the way back, it's slow. Push it all the way forward, it's fast. I still have the switch on the light, just like on the 401. So let's put a needle in it and see what it can sew now. So I haven't threaded the machine or done anything. I just put a needle in it because I want to know how much it can sew. That's all I want to know as of right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my denim test here. And let's just go ahead and start out at two. And I'm going to put it on slow. So there's three layers. One, two, three, four, five. So there's five layers. Six layers. Seven, eight, and nine layers. Look at that. And that's on slow. Flip it over to fast. It'll hammer right through the stuff. Of course, nine layers is a bit much for a singer to slant because I can't, you don't have the extra lift. I can't hardly get Then I'm So eight's about the most you'd ever want to push through a machine like this anyways. Let's do our leather test, shall we? And this is a size 16 needle. I'm going to put it back on slow. So there's one layer. Two layers. Three layers. Four layers. Oh, five layers. Six. Now it's grunt. You can hear it. Six is about its most. But as you can see, I'm not even helping this machine. course one last test let's do vegetable tan belt leather with a with a layer of fabric on it and this time I'm using denim oh it's grunting now but I still didn't have to help it so you can see the speed control it's very good if I barely press this pedal down here this is what I get and then if I flick it over to fast, it runs about like it did factory. Go back over to slow, press the pedal down all the way, that's as fast as I get out of it. With no power loss. Go back to fast. Now I have an awesome machine to work with. Thanks for watching, and if you like our videos, let me know in the comments, and, and we'll continue making more, and hopefully we'll get a little better at video editing, and as time goes, these will get more involved. If you have any comments on my machine, negative, positive, things you'd do different, I want to know. Let us know. Thank you.